How to fix transaction declined in Valorant. Hey everybody, in this video, I'll show you how to fix transaction declined in Valorant. To start this tutorial, firstly, you must close your game and restart it again and again. In here is a simulation of how you will restart your PC. All you need to do is go for the Windows button and then restart. Now let us assume that you have already finished restarting your PC. You will now proceed for search. Over at search, you're going to look for firewall and network protection. Now open this one over here. Make sure you press on it. Now let's wait for the window to appear over here, which is firewall and network protection. Now let's wait for the application to finish loading. Once the window appears, go to firewall and network protection. In here, we are going to click on allow an app through firewall. The first option over here. Now let's click on it. Once we click on it, there will be another window that will appear in your screens right about now. And while we are here, we are going to look for some settings. First, we are going to scroll down. And then we look for Apache HTTP server. In here, we check this one. Once done, we scroll down and then go to change settings. The one with the shield icon. In here, we first check public. And then check the box as well. This is the same Apache HTTP server that we dabbled a while ago in. In here, you're going to look for branch cache, content retrieval. Check first and check public as well. Follow the settings on my screen so that you will be guided. In here, we look for branch cache peer discovery uses WSD. Check both public and uncheck private. And make sure you check the box on the first one as well. Once you are done, you're going to scroll up this time. And then in here, we will be looking for Branch Cache, Content Retrieval, and Peer Discovery, and make sure you follow the same settings over here. And then click on OK. This one over here. Once you click OK, close the windows. Then close your settings this time. And that's it. You may now open Valorant, and it should all fix your problems. Thank you very much for watching this video. Hopefully you get some value in this one. And as always, leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one.